I've known about aphantasia for a long time before watching the video. I've never been able to visualize images in my mind with my eyes closed and the object not being in the room. For example, if there is no green apple in the room and someone asks you to close your eyes and see a green apple in your mind, I can't do this. I also can't hear, taste and touch in my mind. Apparently, there are some people that can do this. I also have alexithymia, where you are not able to pinpoint and describe emotions. Additionally, I might be level 1 autistic which is mildly autistic. I did a lot of tests online and they said I scored high enough so they would recommend me to go for a diagnosis. I don't plan to go for one, but I read about autism news on Spectrum News. And I subscribed to UC Davis Mind Institute. Anyway, the video taught me more stuff that I didn't know about aphantasia. The video used the term visual imagination. So, I don't have visual imagination. It's sometimes called the mind's eye. He said people without aphantasia can't tell how many windows are in their home from visual imagination. Whereas people with aphantasia would use their memory. However, I would have to walk around the house with a piece of paper and a pencil and write down how many windows are in the house. My mom's amniotic fluid sac started leaking when she was pregnant with me. And she had to be induced with Pitocin, which makes the contraction stronger and labor more painful. So I was told. I was also four or five weeks premature. I don't remember. So I don't know if I got brain damage from that. The guy in the video says that some people have aphantasia after getting a stroke, which I knew. I also had John this as a baby but I don't think that would contribute to brain damage. But I could be wrong. It seems that people with aphantasia remember less objects in a room when drawing a picture and don't remember the color of the objects. Also, people that don't have aphantasia get scared by reading books as if it was a scary movie. People with aphantasia don't get scared by these descriptions. 